What's going on guys? This is Rona and today's episode we're going to talk about the time remapping. So let's get started. Alright guys, now we are inside of After Effect as before. If you recall the previous episode, there we were talking about this uh, stretch column. But for now, we will talk about time remapping. Time remapping is uh, similar to the stretching. The only uh, difference between these in the stretching uh, time stretch or we can say this stretch column, there were no keyframe involved in this. But the time remapping, we, we have to deal with the uh, keyframing and as well as we have more control over the layer we can speed up and slow down the clip and as well as we can reverse the time and so uh, for that let's get started uh, before i apply the time remapping on the layer uh, i want you to observe these uh, black edges of the layer uh, from this way and this way okay let's apply the time remapping let's right click on the layer go to time unable time remapping or you can use the shortcut shortcut from uh, control alt t as you can see uh, once we apply the time remapping uh, the black edges uh, disappeared from the layer and we have two keyframes these two keyframes define the uh, original speed of the layer so let's say we want uh, this clip to slow down uh, so simply we have to increase the distance from each other these keyframes so select the last keyframe increase the distance from first one to last one and uh, we have to extend the layer as well okay so let me ramp review this Alright guys, as you can see, now we have uh, done uh, this thing, we slow down the clip, but uh, it's a little bit sharp here, but don't worry for that for yet, uh, because uh, we will cover that part of next episode. Okay guys, now let's say we want motion to reverse, so we simply reverse these keyframe, select these keyframe and we have to simply replace these keyframes or we can say we have to replace reverse these keyframes so let's ramp review this all right guys as you can see here now we have this reverse motion of the by simply reversing the keyframes uh, as you can see but uh, I wanna show you one more thing uh, once we across this the last keyframe we have no keyframe in there because we have their still keyframe still footage so uh, one uh, another important thing I wanna show you is that let's say we want uh, the clip to fast from here to there in this area we want clip to be fast on the further we want this clip to be slow so we have to simply uh, move the time indicator and we have to create another keyframe by simply click on this keyframe button and we want this area to be fast but we simply have to decrease the distance of both of these and uh, we want this area to be slowed down so we have to increase the distance from here to there let me show you all right guys as you can see there we have a fast clip and once we cross the second keyframe the clip is slowed down all right guys that's the end of this episode i hope you enjoy today's episode if you really like this video please don't forget to hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and once you subscribe that you will have a brand new episode at every saturday and sunday so see you guys in the next time